Hey there folks, welcome to another Found Free with Red Shirts. Pretty quick after the last one for PlayStation Plus, this time Epic Games. Uh, we've got, not here, just a bit down, there we go. We've got two games for you that are available until December 13th. Um, first up is Gigabash. And Gigabash, we're gonna have to oh, unrate it, so we don't know what kind of game it will be. Um, claim your place as King Wong Titans. Gigabash is a multiplayer arena brawler with gigantic film-inspired kaiju. Okay, I'm interested. Larger than life heroes, earth-shattering special attacks, and fully destructible environments. So basically, kaiju and Power Ranger-like uh, uh, entities. Titles like uh, combines the chaos and creativity of titles like Power Stone, Super Smash Bros. Ultimate, and War of Monsters with the jaw-dropping skill of the classic kaiju movies. Plays either a rampaging titan or a titan hunting mecha. Summon lightning from the heavens, use a radio tower as a baton, or roll a whole district and your enemies into a single massive snowball. Okay, call for roster 10 unique characters in battle mode, each with their own movement and playstyle. Mm -mm. Time your attack, block your opponents, okay, yeah. Uh, classic free for all, up to four players. Pair up in 2v2, wage war around the world. Up on the couch to challenge up to three friends with a local multiplayer. Nice. Nobody home, no problem, just head online. Uh, discover the origins and misadventures of the Titans in four unique single player campaigns. I like that. They're each their own oversized protagonist. Dual mode challenging play from around the world. And a party mode with a variety of mini games. Also, Ultraman 4 character Characters Pack, that's interesting. Ultraman Anime uh, Character Pack, there's a Godzilla Kaiju Pack with official Kaiju, official Godzilla support. With Godzilla, Gigan, Mecha Godzilla, and Destroyer. Oh man, that's amazing. Yeah, this looks to be very, very fun. Stupid fun, but fun. So that's gonna get added for sure. I would suggest trying it, especially if, if you have a friend or something you can play this with. Absolutely do that. Gigabash, I did not know that existed. I missed that in my life. Continue browsing and we go back to the second game, which is a predecessor. Also until December 13th. Let's see what it is. Predecessor is a paragon fueled fast-paced action game that combines MOBA and first-person uh, shooter gameplay, putting you at the heart fight with a strategic choice. That actually sounds like the game Paragon. I think that tanked at, a, at some point. Third-person control and immersive action. But they were talking about first-person shooters. Okay. An early access game. Normally it was about 9 euros, so not too special, but it might be fun. Um... Over 30 heroes to choose from, new heroes frequently joining the roster. Uh, archers, rage, cage fight robots. Uh, um, purchase the base game or one of the early access bundles is the only way to play predecessor. Uh, early access give players the opportunity to have an advanced look at the game while providing feedback. After the early access, it will be free to play. So you basically get early access because they want to. Uh, um, uh, there's not a lot. I can see it. Uh, wow. Okay, the legendary bundle is 77 euros. The epic bundle is 84. Rare bundle is 19. And then there normally is a normal predecessor that's 9. And now, well, 8 or euros and 9 cents. And now it's free. And then there's also in game points you can buy for 6 to. Hold on. 6 up to. Wow, 94 euros. That's quite a bit. But if it's a good game, I do understand that there need to be monies to be earned. I will be checking this out because it does look interesting, but I am not really a fan of mobiles. But if you are, why not? Let's try it out. It's free now. Let's add that to the pool. And that's it for today. Um, like I said, these are available until December 13th. I will be seeing you again then, and I hope you are enjoying your games. Okay. Bye.